Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Callan, our Animal Crossing Let's Play Island. I'm just looking at that tree stump. It looks kind of funny. Anyway, yesterday um, in our week of Let's Plays, we had a little bit of a CC, a coastal crisis. Um, but you know what? I think um, whatever happens, we'll figure out a way. Now what you see here is exactly how we left it last time. There's a lot of, you know, freshly planted trees that we need to figure out. Um, a few like started kind of projects, like a little uh, group that you can like sit down in and like wait for your spa treatment thing going, um, at spa treatment to, waiting for your spa treatment to start you know what i'm saying anyway um and i would say this is exactly where we're going to continue because i would like to work on this area a little bit more um i was just kind of standing here or like you know ending last episode and then i i got up and got like a fresh drink and everything and then i looked at this again i was like that's quite a lot of empty space over there and i'm not actually sure that there's gonna be anything over here um so either this could be completely filled with trees or because we have the lake here which i did want to have like a view for maybe we built up another cliff that would kind of make this like sunken area a little bit more impressive also um i just don't know actually like let's figure it out together because i'm not sure the spacing behind the house is going to be enough but it could almost be like this balcony moment so um i guess we could build it up here and here see that's not going to be enough okay right we could have this part here just not round it like up against the house that could be fine i would like to round this though and i can round this Okay, how about extending it? That would still allow us to have those tree over here, uh, those trees over here. And that also might be like a little bit much. Maybe this is enough. Because that way I've got three tiles wide, which means this can be rounded and this can be rounded. Okay. Um, so I would need to add something here to be able to round that. It's a lot of planning, a lot of, you know, very uh, meticulous rounding planning. <laughs> Okay, um, right. That will allow us to round this. And we can round this as well. Depending on how we want this clip to go. Okay, let's look at this from the front. Alright, yeah, I don't mind anything. Like, I, I actually think this is gonna be kind of cute. Um, but, you know, I think it needs to be extended towards the left. I think there was still a little bit too much air. What day is it? The 10th of April. Okay, I think earlier on in the day, on the 10th of April. Ooh, okay, for this to be rounded, it kind of needs to be like that. And then probably one more. Um, Earlier on, on the 10th of April, there were more clouds, which I think also helps with with this entire, like, uh, you know, sky hating that I like to do. <laughs> okay. Uh, would this be like too straight of a of a cliff? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, let me round this part and then check it from the front. Yeah. Hmm. All right. I th I think it needs one more tile, maybe. And I don't know how that would look from the, fr the the front, but maybe this also just needs one more tile. So the house is like caged in there, you know, and then this could be like a vine. And maybe we make this like an official thing with like having a, like an actual ladder here. I know there's like blue ladders and then you could kind of like just head up here. Maybe have. Oh, I don't know, like a a bench somewhere, you know, but this is kind of a nice view. You know, after your spa treatment or whatever else my house is going to be, you could just go up here, enjoy the view. Why not? Like, this is... <laughs> That's cute, right? Again, we're still definitely missing a whole bunch of, um, a whole bunch of decorations around the lake, uh, which is going to be interesting anyway, because, you know, the lake doesn't have that many tiles around it. And it still needs pathing and hopefully some trees, so who knows? All right, that might be too much. Uh, so this would be rounded, and then I guess like I'll I'll try and like round everything over here, and then we'll nope, <laughs> we'll see it from the front again. All right, so this and one more I think. So this could be the incline. All right, so round this, 
and around this and then let's see that again from the front actually that is kind of cute right i think that is kind of cute all right and then this will be a ladder uh meaning that here can just be like a vine and that can just be like a vine okay um do i have a ladder setup kit i kind of doubt it uh which means i should put that on the list the list that I still haven't really started, I think. I just have a ladder, like a normal, boring ladder. Okay, do I have the recipe for it? I do. Okay, wait, we're going to craft it then. We need one ladder and five wood. Okay, that's, that's fine. Uh, I still got my workbench, right? Yep, workbench is up. I have no regular wood in my pockets. Good. Very, very good to know. I don't think we're going to need our ladder anymore now that we've got like, you know, vines and most of the island has like inclines to go places. So we can just take the one that we've got here and then we'll need to grab some wood. There we go. And I will also already grab this just to change it to white. We're going to have to put another design on it once we've got, we've got that. But, um, yeah, we can check out if the white is going to work out after all. Okay, so ladder setup kit. There we go. Keep crafting. Actually, no, don't keep crafting. Instead, go customize, please. That would be nice. All right, and then wooden ladder setup kit. Yes, which is going to be... Oh, we could do blue or white. All right, I'm going to try blue because I feel like that would be ni like a nice little attention grabbing moment. And since, you know, the sign is already going to be white in front, like that would be fine, maybe. Angled signpost, that's right. I also got that one. Um, okay, white. And then, you know what? I kind of maybe just want to put something on there so that you, you, you have this idea of, oh, maybe we can do bulletin board. Okay, maybe. I don't know if that'll look stupid here. But maybe we can do like the bulletin board in in the sense that like that that'll have the course schedule, right? Like right in front of the house, so you can see it. You can see whether you want to go there or not. Okay, and then this does have the home, which would fit if we want to have it kind of here. All right, so angled signpost. No. <laughs> I was gonna. I was. I was like briefly wondering. Wait, didn't I just customize it? It should be a different color then. That is correct. I mean, I don't hate it, I think. And then this here could be like another flower, you know? Okay, and then let's put the wooden ladder setup kit here. Yeah. Yeah. I I think that works just because you're immediately going to be like, oh, there's something there. Like, you need to climb up, you know? It's not just like, a, oh, you know, vines that decorate the cliff. No. Get your... Get your but up here and look at that, you know? <laughs> okay, nice. Um, we do already have a couple of things set up over here. I still kind of need to decide on what type of stools I want. I think for that, we need the fences to grow in. Uh, the fences to grow in, yeah. I mean, that would be, that would be interesting. <laughs> Having fences grow in, I'm not quite sure about that. Okay, and then, you know, speaking of fences though, I think up here we could maybe work in some fences. I believe I've only got the white ones with me right now, but we also have the option of blue ones. So that could work. So maybe like two here and then maybe another one over here. I kind of like that. I kind of like that. It's a lot of white. So I'm just going to go also grab, um, yeah, no, I think we can leave the weed fields in our pockets. I'm pretty sure we're going to need them. So I'm just going to grab the other variation of the wooden fence there we go get something out and i just also wanted to check do i have the oh i have one i have one no i have three bistro tables because these also could be an idea here i will take the log bench with us um and then we'll grab a little boxy stool uh and then what was i going in here for oh fencing yeah there we go uh, different fencing. There we go. Blue fencing. And then just to exchange this real quick. Because I'm that, yeah, I don't know. Might just tie in a little bit more of that blue 
which I think might be quite nice. We could still bring in the white back in with um, a bit of flower stuff, but especially in comparison to like the storefront here, you know, because that would be a lot of like white colored things against each other. Yeah, I think I kind of prefer that also because there are the white log sticks in the front, so it wouldn't be repetitive, you know? And then we can keep the white ones here or we can also change them to blue. Um, depending on the chairs around it, which I did want to try out maybe the bistro tables, or like one. <laughs> Depending on how many we can fit in. Boxy stool, weed field. And let me also unwrap this one. Angled signpost. Still maybe need to check if we can put that in somewhere. Oh, well, I mean, that would also be an idea. I mean, that would maybe even be an idea, like... Uh, dang it. Like, here. And then we just change the pathing a little bit. So one goes here, and then the other goes... Did I get a second one? A gazebo. No, that's, that's, that's what I want. Hello! <laughs> Don't tell me this isn't enough space. I mean... I honestly kind of like that it you know and then maybe even like bring another one I'm not sure how like we're gonna walk here can you still walk here mm -mm. yeah spacing on them is weird huh okay well I was very happy to have this as a tree and then I quite like this as a tree also um, yeah I mean we could have another one over here somehow that is cute! I'm just trying to imagine everything with like filled in like flowers and all that kind of stuff and I'm liking that a lot. And I also need to think about like the sunken area. I think I want the sunken area to maybe have uh, just like a, t like a few trees but like tiny trees. And I need to- there's not that many opportunities for us to even put trees because like so this wouldn't be one and then this Ah, this wouldn't be one either, right? So, that already kind of sucks. <laughs> not gonna lie. <laughs> that already kind of sucks. I'm not even sure, like, maybe this could be one. Yeah, that could be a tree, but that would be the same tile as the coconut, so I don't want that to be a tree. Alright, so this could be maybe one? Or we'll move that further over to the side. Or maybe could this be one? That could maybe be one. Yeah, so maybe like, ah, uh, ah, <laughs> I think that can be one. Yes, that can be one. Okay, good. So maybe that one, and then maybe this one, like moving further to the front, and then maybe we'll have another one here, uh, like this. All right, and then this will be that one. And then apart from that, I think I want to have some shell items, some dropped shells, as though kind of like maybe... I don't know, like that's not the best thing to think about, but maybe there was this giant wave that just brought over some stuff uh, that's just that was just kind of left here, you know? I don't know. Or maybe people just throw their shells here, which I that's not too good either, is it? But, you know. Okay, so... Um, bamboo? Since it's towards the back, this could be something like a tiny bit taller. And then maybe... I kind of want to have more than one bamboo, I think. One, this one could be like a green one. And then maybe the one to the front could be like a green hardwood. And then maybe this will be another bamboo, but it'll be like a different stage, you know? And then this here, what did I just say? <laughs> um, Yeah, like a... A green, a green hardwood, right? That's what I said, I think. Yeah, and then, I mean, I don't know. We can try and find some shell items, and then we'll have to do some time traveling. I've been putting that off since forever, and I also just want to check because this here could be a tree. It could be a hardwood. Yeah, let's do green hardwood. 
Um, I don't want to do too much because, you know, we obviously still would want to be able to walk here. Oh, <laughs> T-Bone just sat down and then was like, ah, no, that's not quite it. That's, that's not the perfect way to sit. Um, gazebo, I was going to say, I got a log bench. Uh, okay. <laughs> Maybe log bench more like up against it. Yes. And then push. Don't know what that looks like from the front, but so you could actually sit here if you wanted to. Oh my god, look at us right now. Ah, uh, isn't that just perfect? No, T-Bone, sit down. Dang it. <laughs> ah, what a view, you know? What a view. Or, or maybe here. You know, so it's even further behind the house. I don't know, we already have weed fields downstairs, but I have this strong urge to have like a weed field here. And then towards the front. But I think that's a little doubly doubly. Yeah. Depending on how many weed fields we want to slap into this area, it would be cute. It would be cute. Absolutely. But it could also just be something else, you know? Um, like a, a flower, and then we can... Or maybe we just do, do like one, and then a flower in front, so it's not too many weed fields in one spot. Yeah, and then I mean, I can also... Just do like fencing, but that you can't, you can't get close enough, maybe? Uh, yep. I squeeze past this? Mm-hmm. Or just maybe these two as pieces of fencing, and then you kind of stand here. Looks a little odd. I don't know. Um, I'm I'm guessing that you know if I watch this back, I'm gonna be like that actually looked totally fine because that does happen to me quite often. All right, no other tree spots here. I think. Yeah, no other tree spots are I I think are gonna be a little bit weird. We also have to figure out if that tree should maybe only be like a second or third stage. Um, but yeah, I think the bistro tables are not the worst idea. You don't see them from like right here just yet, but you kind of see them as you walk past. And that might not be the worst idea. Um, but again, you know, could also be shifted over so that like, let's say the first one kind of is here. Um, with, I don't know which way around. <laughs> Maybe like that. You know? And then maybe there's just like the second one is going to be like somewhere over here. And if I can find it again. Wild Long Bench? No. Gazebo? No. Signpost? No. <laughs> Fister Table. There we go. <laughs> yeah, more inwards then. Was Pate just... What is Pate doing all the way back there? Eating a sandwich? Is she eating a sandwich? Sounds about right. Maybe she's having a bit of anxiety about like an upcoming concert or something and she just is taking some time off. I don't know. I did kind of like the one that protruded out. Is that the is that the right word? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I need to time travel. I keep putting it off. Okay, we're going to do it right now. Uh, those trees are planted. Just one more thing. Just, just, just one more thing, okay? <laughs> I want to get a shell partition. Um, and then maybe other shell items that I still have. I don't think there's many. Um, <laughs> nope. Oh, shell partition. There we go. It's going to be like, oh, maybe we don't have any. Shell partition. We do have these. But they don't come in like the best customization. Um, so maybe instead we'll have to use the music player, which I do not have any of. And I also do not have any of the lamps. I have one music player. Do I have a lamp? Nope. Nope, I don't. I do not. Okay, well. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, well, let's put down the shell partition. Because I thought that that would be nice, kind of uh, up against the cliff here. Um, boxy stool, shell speaker, partition. There we go. 
you know? And then I think we'll have to clear some, some weeds in certain spots. That was just small ones anyway, so we can put something down here, but maybe like the shell speaker could be, you know, just kind of drop behind there or more to the front, maybe more like here, something maybe in between. Yeah. Alrighty, let's go time travel. Let's go skip, um, I believe two days, right? Because everything that we've planted would need to grow at least two days. Um, we've actually planted a whole bunch of other stuff in certain places too. Like I think there's some stuff towards the front here. Do I even remember what I wanted those as? <laughs> I think I do, right? Hi, Flurry. How are you doing? Oh yeah, two days. Okay, uh, let's time skip. Okay, trees have started growing in. Oh, and my phone is ringing. Oh, cause I sell, I sold some fish to the drop-off box. Yeah, me. Eh. Okay, whatever. Alrighty, so. Okay, tiny, tiny, tiny trees everywhere. These all, like the coconuts. Oh, yes. Ooh, that's good. Should we already stunt? Yeah, we'll stunt the bamboo, the, the one on the right hand side, and we will stunt the one to the front, I think. So this one will be stunted. I still have some saplings, that's very good. And then this will also be stunted. We can just put that maybe to the front for now. It would definitely be nice if we can maybe incorporate some, um, some wheat fields to this area as well. Okay, and then see, this is kind of cute already. Maybe one more stage. Maybe one more stage could be very cute. Mm hmm. All right, let me check. So I think the ones behind the house, I'll just let those grow. So let's not worry about them. Um, I believe both of these still at least one more day. I'll check my mailbox at another time. Um. Maybe also one more day. Ooh, and then here's where it gets complicated. If we're gonna do the bistro table, wait, this is the same tile as that one? I don't like that. Which I guess this could be brought over. Oh, I don't know. No, that is not, no. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Um, medium young pair. There we go. Oh, that's kind of tough decisions now with the with the tables here. Because if if we've got that tree now, this would be like the perfect spot to put a table in there. Somewhat. Spacing is, is still gonna be like a little weird. I think we should still let those grow. I think we should still let these this one here grow and this and this. That one's stunted already, right? Yeah, that one's stunted. This one needs to grow a little bit further. Um this one needs to grow one more stage so that it's like a third stage tree. I don't think we change anything else here. Uh, that one was already completely exchanged, yes. That one in front is stunted and then that one needs to grow another day as well. Oh, right, and then this here. Oh, it might work with the, with the pole thing that I was worried about. Oh, that's gonna look cute though, I think. I do think, you know, the, the decorations are bringing the coastal vibes in a little bit more as well. Alrighty. Oh yeah, this needs to be stunted. This one right here. There we go. And then... Yeah, one more day for most of this. Hi, Flurry. Oh my god, you still- you have a, the regular watering can. Good morning, and here's hoping it'll be a good day. Today's already fun. I want to give them more personality, but like, sorry for not getting up. I'm really comfortable here. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's just, it's, it's, it's just hard to give them personality, you know? Ooh, it's a cute candle. I'm not sure we're going to need candles, but that would be a, a good fit. 
and then some sturdy wood furniture. I want to see if they've got maybe the, um, no, no elephant watering can. Because we should gift, we should gift uh, our villagers cute watering cans, right? Excuse me. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, but even now when there's nothing, nothing green, I do believe the coconut trees are helping. Again, I, I haven't read the comments yet because I've I've been recording this in like one setting at one sitting, but um definitely looking forward to your evaluation of, of that. But yeah. Okay, I think that's all the trees. So one more day it is. Okay. I am liking coming out of my house now. Oh gosh. Okay. Um now I would like to stun this one. And as you can hear from the music, maybe the fishing tournament is happening today. Uh, I am not gonna, <laughs> not gonna participate, but you know. Okay, I think we also actually, let me get the stun de-stunned. Nope, um, because I think we definitely should stop the coconut tree from growing any further because there is already a, t a tall grown one on the left-hand side. That might be too much. Okay, so nursery cherry goes there. Yeah, I do think the coconut tree here should also be stopped now. Should be stopped. Okay, so um, I'll stunt that one to the front. Oh, is this lag already? Oh my gosh. All right, and I mean, we do have some fencing here, so maybe we'll put down... Oh my god, it is lagging <gasps> so badly, though. What's going on? Oh my god, are you kidding me? This is... I hate this. This this part about island decorating, I really hate. Oh my god, already? This game... This game can't stomach, like, anything. Ooh, okay, well, our bamboo is growing. I actually think our bamboo uh, in the sunken part maybe needs to move further to the right-hand side. Yeah, actually, let's do that. And then uh, we also need to move the one in front. And that might be... Um, the stage might already be enough. Okay, so this here would be our bamboo. There we go. And then let's climb up and see it from the front. Yeah, I like the bamboo better now. I'm not sure where to put the hardwood though. Um, let's see what tiles would even be like a possibility for us. We could move it just, like, further to the front here also. You know? So... That would be our hardwood. Hmm. Or not. <laughs> I don't know. Or maybe the bamboo moves over now that the hardwood has been moved, and then we incorporate, like, a vine right here against the cliff. Now I've removed some tall grown weeds for this, and I keep changing my opinion about it. That is not so good. Okay, let's stunt the tree to the side here. I have a vine implemented. The shell could now move to the side of it. Ah yeah, maybe that's better. Yep, yeah, maybe that's better. And I think I want to move the shell to the front where our hardwood used to be. I think that one might be a good... Oh, no, no, no music. We could play music on it, um, but we don't have to. I don't think like whenever we use the shell item, um, we can also just use it without music. Uh, let me put a puddle underneath, just like so. And then we're going to place down our shell speaker. There we go. Yep, this way around is pretty nice, or this way around also works. And yeah, maybe this way around. Oh yeah, okay, now I like the sunken part a little bit more, I think. Um, I'd like to incorporate a couple more flowers there. Um, maybe we can also bring in some wheat fields. Um, especially towards that left side, you know, since we're on it. Uh, we can still kind of do that. So like, I would maybe just get rid of this one, stunt it towards the back here. And then we're going to have to pluck some of those tall grow weeds. I think it's okay, though. We're still going to keep, like, the main ones, you know? Okay, and then this is going to be, like, maybe some shells. Some cutesy little shells right there. Like these. Uh-huh. And then I should still have weed fields with me. Yes, number one. Number one. 
and there's number two. Wait, okay, perfect. Um, I think that might be good tree size for this as well. So we stunned this one. Perfect. And then let's go back down and check it from like the front and also check these trees. So these two are stunned here. That one isn't stunted just yet. But judging like these two already have the same size, maybe this one needs to be fully grown. Um... Yeah, I don't love this with the table now. Ah, the, the position of the bistro tables are a thing that I don't know what to do with. Because like, you know. Just have like the little book showing or the plant maybe. And then one of them is here. And the other one is going to be here, and then that's enough for the area. I think we're going to have to remove that one weed so we can pull it, like, closer. Yeah, that would be nice. Okay, let's get rid of this one and then move it inwards like this. And then we can still have, like, I think I have the Moroccan footrest with me. It's so far away. <laughs> oh my god, it is so freaking far away. Are you kidding me with that? I think that's the that's how these are, right? That's unfortunately how it'll go. And we might not incorporate like a, a chair here because you can't see it anyways. Okay, um that has some custom designs left over, but it won't have them, so we can just stunt that um bamboo to the side here. Now we're gonna see the area mostly like this. Yeah, I don't think we should let our uh, cedar tree grow any further. The hardwood is going to grow further, but we shouldn't let this one grow any further. So maybe we just need to remove another code and then also stunt it. That is that correct? Yeah, that's correct. Almost out of peaches. Oh, no. Yeah, let's let this one grow. So it's different to that. And also maybe the hardwood. Let me look at the hardwood from the front. Okay, we stunted the coconut. That's good. I mean, the, the hardwood can grow a little further. I think I wouldn't mind that growing a tiny bit further. Okay, this one here needs to be stunted. Peach goes in. There we go. Um, Maybe we could just grab a couple of pears. Or one. <laughs> That's actually kind of good, though, because, you know, for, like, the final tour, I don't want to have to go through, like, too many, too many, um, shake, like, Hair tree shaking uh, moments, and then have to find all of the all of the pears that fall down. So having them disappear is honestly kind of what I want to happen in the long run. Okay, so let's go and make a stunty sapling over here because I can't plant anything when I stand there. And then we jump, and then we plant. Oh my god, the lag is starting. Oh no. Okay, you know what? I I know that there's a lot of people or like quite a few people have commented things like, you know, I actually play like quite differently compared to you, but like I still enjoy watching the Let's Play, which first of all, thank you. But um, so I'm wondering, to those of you who play in like a different style or also there's quite a few who are just starting to play, do you think that I already have like a ton of items on my island? Because the lag is starting to get real here. Like, if you see me run across this bridge, it's like, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> One of these days, maybe I will be able to decorate an island without lag, but honestly, not in this lifetime. Not like this. Truthfully. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, well, you know what? I feel like that deserves a picture. Oh my god, but look at them. They're so cute. I love the fact that Flurry and Tutu are standing next to each other, you know, because they are kind of like sisters. And then Alice is kind of too shy to, to join in or what's happening over there. What's happening with Alice? Hello, everyone. 
<laughs> Look at the idiots. Oh my god, everyone's just trying to catch that one fish. Alice, are you are you okay, honey? Can I move you out of the way and then you can maybe go towards the water? You got this. Come on. Come on, Alice, you got this. Oh no, she just likes looking at it. Maybe she just cheers the others on. She's kind of like, come on, y'all. God, if you compare Gala and Alice's eyes and Tutu's eyes, they're all very different, but all beautiful. And if that doesn't teach you a lesson, I don't know what does. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Let's check if maybe my, my able sister has Birkenstocks. There's a figure skating dress. Okay, probably not Birkenstocks, but kind of like these glittery sandals. <laughs> we'll take a look. Oh my god, I have barely any money left. Okay. Um, let's see. Anything here? Nope. 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 Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Some cute tights, but nothing nothing that I would want to wear. <sighs> yeah. Not really, right? Okay, let me get these shoes, but I will not wear them. Nope. Oh, and I see Pate over here. Okay, Pate just fishing by herself. She needs the concentration, you know? We we uh we don't judge. Oh, Hornsby has one of those houses. Hornsby's house is honestly really beautiful. I don't know if I'll keep the door because the door does give me like these fishing village kind of vibes. So we might give him more of a rustic door. Hi, Daily. Oh my God, Daily, you look so cute. The little hat. Oh my God, no, stop. That is so cute. I don't have any vines with me. I wanted to put something on there. Is Dottie doing fine? Is she, does she not want to take part in it? Hi, Dottie. Oh, I forgot how pretty your interior is. It's really cute. I would honestly... Okay, she loves working out. We can see that happening here again. You know, she's the retired athlete on this island. Dottie, how are you? Oh, hey, Maline. How have you been? I haven't seen you around. Have you been avoiding me? Oh, you goof. I'm always happy to chat with you. <gasps> I'm sorry. Not intentionally, anyways. Do you need something? Uh, let's just chat, you know? Did you know I'm basically a beach volleyball pro? Okay, so we came up with the storylines for a reason, right? Because they fit the different villagers, but Dottie is so like creepily accurate. I'm, do they, are they listening to us? Are they listening? And then, oh gosh. Um, well, but yeah, I did know Dottie because you're a retired athlete. You're really good at any type of sports. We should hit the beach and play. Um, sure. Absolutely. Yeah, Maline, I knew you'd agree. You're the best. Having fun right next to the ocean. It's like all the little things that bother me just go away. Oh my god, we literally placed her perfectly then. She lives very close to the ocean. Oh my god, that warms my heart. Um, before before that happened, though, I was just gonna say, um, you know, she likes doing sports, so we, I do want to translate that over into her interior. But I could maybe try and like keep most of these aspects, you know. So we'll keep like um, maybe some parts of the furniture, the wallpaper, but like just change the colors, maybe. Gosh, Dottie is working out a lot, a lot, a lot. <laughs> yeah. She, she has this perfect, and then the waterfalls remind her of like the ocean breeze. And if she, she, if she wants to go to the ocean, she just needs to hop over here and she's right there. Yeah, and she'll get like a volleyball net, maybe somewhere over here to the left side. I want to do like a yoga spot. I'm very excited now. I don't know, that just reassures me, you know? We're, we're doing something right here. Okay. Oh, Alice joined in! Yay! All right, and T-Bone kind of over here doesn't want to bother the ladies, you know. You don't, you silly, you don't have to worry about that. They'll tell you if you need, you know, you need to go away. Maybe, maybe, um, maybe Flurry and him are still kind of shy around each other. And he, he doesn't want to like, oh my god, I love, they're standing so close because they're sisters. Okay, this is too cute. I'm sorry, I'm basically just running around, but like, I feel like I should do this more. Like, we should interact with the villagers more because this is, you know, their personalities that make them who they are. All right, and then uh, Daisy is also home. Let's check in on her and see if she's all right, you know? Daisy! Oh my god. Ooh, wait, are you also doing yoga? Why is your TV on the ground? <laughs> 
All right. I also love your interior or at least the start of it. I can definitely leave this wallpaper, I would say, and we can give her like some books. I would definitely want to include some like outfit stuff, you know? Yeah. How are you doing, Daisy? So fun to have you come over for a late visit like this, Bow Wow. A late visit? What time is it? <laughs> it's so rare that I can manage to reel in any huge fish I spot offshore. I get so frustrated sometimes, but I try to tell myself I can learn to fish as well as you with practice. Oh, is she worried about her, like, her skills? Is, does she not want to take part in the fishing tournament because she's worried about her skills? Is that it? Oh, Daisy, honey. We're not going to judge you, though, you know? We're not going to judge her. Bye. I didn't notice that her, um, her mouth opens so wide when she waves. That was very cute. All right, I, d I remember, I don't exactly remember what I said um, because that was like Saturday, um, but I, I know that I said I wanted the small covered round table here. Oh yeah, that's that's much better. That's much better with like a custom design. And then we need something else for, we need something else for Daisy because th this isn't, we could put the pile of Zen cushions here though. And then I have the Moroccan footrest here. And then maybe this will just be like the, like a wooden stool. I think that might be a better distribution, you know, and then we can put some different different fabrics. I've got the log chair with me. Uh, we can try it out with this, though. Oh, wait, no, log. I was going to I was thinking of log stool, you know, OK, we don't have their pictures anyways. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, my God. Wait, OK, look, this area is coming together a little bit more. I like it. Ooh, I like it. There's so much filler still left, but I, st I, I like it. OK, you know what? You know what? How long have I been recording? 50 minutes. Okay. You know, taking the risk that this will be like a bit of a longer episode and these last few minutes weren't really interesting in terms of the decorating part. Uh, let me maybe see if I've got anything that I can gift my villagers. We will redo their houses anyway. So it kind of, it's going to be fine if, you know, they put this, this stuff up in their houses. But oh, we could just give them like um, fruit maybe. What is my native fruit? Is my native fruit uh, peaches? I can check that in my passport, right? <laughs> yeah, okay, peaches. Okay, so we'll go and grab some pears. We'll grab some pears and we'll gift my villagers maybe. Let's grab some of these. Do I have any wrapping paper? Um, no. Okay, that's fine. Do I have any more like watering cans? Cause like we could definitely gift them like an elephant watering can. Yeah, but I don't currently have enough. I've got four. All right, you know what we're going to do? We're going to order more. I think maybe we'll just give them the... Um, where do you find them again? Oh, wait. I think here, right? That's tools, yes. Um, maybe we'll just go for like the gray one. So it's kind of like more of the basic. Oh my God, they're so expensive. Okay, I need more money. <laughs> Oh God, the, the grind, the, the stuff or like the time certain things take, it's too much. Alrighty, well for today we'll gift them some fruit. So let's go and wrap up um, some, some pears. I'm gonna do these like individually. I need some wrapping paper first. I need some money first. Okay, wow, oh, so many stages. So many different stages, so many things to do. Okay, first stop, resident services to get some more money. I don't know if you just heard that, but there was like a super loud rumbling sound. I took like a short break, but it somewhat lasted. I'm not sure. It almost sounded like thunder to start with, but then I'm pretty sure that it ended up being something else. I have no idea. Okay, uh, 200,000 left in our bank. Ooh, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Um, okay, we've got the money. We apparently got miles, maybe from like ordering. Yeah, from spending money. Great. You know, it's a, a round, round thingy, like a back and forth. What is that? I'm not sure. But you, you, you earn money, you spend money is basically what I wanted to say. Okay, and then we're going to continue placing the, the orders for elephant watering cans. And that limits us to five. And I think we need to go one more day because then we would have like 10. And then our second stop is going to be Nook's Cranny to check for some wrapping paper. 
All right. Ooh, you know what? I actually might purchase this because I feel like it would be fun uh, or it makes sense to put a first aid kit in Dottie's place, you know, with the working out and stuff. She definitely would know how to take care of like injuries as well. And she would want to pre be prepared for that, you know? Um, oh yeah, we actually got some with with blue as well. I will take five and I will take another five. So I've got the 10. There we go. All right. Nice. Okay, and then we can start wrapping our, our, our pears. <laughs> They're gonna be so happy when they see these. Oh my gosh, you know. When have you ne have you ever like not loved a an individually wrapped pear as like a present? Although, you know, it's just like an everyday little present. For that, it's super cute. Imagine someone comes up to you, has like an individually wrapped pear, and it's like, you know what, I just, I thought of you, I wanted to give you something cute, and like, this is it. You'd be like, aww. You didn't have to do that. You're you're gonna be like a pear. Thanks. <laughs> you know. <laughs> All right. Alrighty. Let's start. I'm not sure I can gift any of you anything. I'm scared to take my eyes off of my bobber. Okay. So if they're if they're fishing, we can't gift them anything. Tell you what. We are gonna go and skip a day then because everyone's just fishing right now. We're gonna skip a day, which I think will um, also make all of the trees grow to the right sizes. And then we'll do a round of gifting our villagers, okay? Ah, uh, what lovely weather. <laughs> but still, gosh, the house is coming together and I am so excited for it. I really think this is looking very cute. Okay, I just wanna test something. We can also bring this just like closer. Maybe these are just standing desks. You know, my character could just stand here and drink the coffee. It's just for a chill little spot because I feel like that also works. We don't have to do the Moroccan foot rest and then instead we can plant some some flowers around it. And then we'll have to adjust the pathing, which we might do in just a second. Okay, but first things first, a resins for our villagers. No, actually, first things first, more elephant watering cans because duh. <laughs> I don't know, okay? I, I I don't I don't know. It's Monday and stuff's hard. You're actually watching this on a Friday, I think, but it is Monday for me. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get like not everything, everything. Maybe we can just purchase like a few more weed fields, depending on how many more I can purchase. Maybe two. All right, two. And that was it. Okay, perfect. So that being done, now let's go and gift the villagers some fresh fruit. If I can find any of them. Hi, Daily. Are you playing with the skate sk scooter? Scooter? I think so. Hi, how are you doing? Uh, do you want this, Daily? Oh, what are you giving me? Oh my god, his ears match his outfit. Are you kidding me? That's cute. I wonder what's inside. I'm going to open it. A pear! Yummy! It looks so good! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Oh, Moline, I'm gonna lay on the floor and eat that. Might even share it with the bugs. That's... I don't need that information, you know? I wanna thank you here, man! A relay tank! I hope you like it, Monch. I'm sure I will. I'll wear it so often, you know? I really treasure it. Okay, I can't gift anything to Daisy, because she is sitting down right now. Um, might still talk. Oh, hi, Flurry. <gasps> hi, Fluffle. How are you doing? Good afternoon. Okay, here is a gift for you as well. Uh, I've got a perfect, perfect present. You are not ready. Can I go ahead and open this? Oh, this is great. It's a pear. Thanks. That is so thoughtful of you. As a thank you, please take my Kung Fu tea. Yeah, sure. Sh sh sure. Okay, uh, Daisy, just a quick chat. How's your day going, Bow Wow? Um, great. Bow Wow, wish I hadn't held my laundry out to dry before this rain. Oh, yeah, no, that sucks. Ugh. Sorry about that. I mean, I didn't do it, but, you know. All right, Dottie is... <laughs> Come rain or thunder, you know, sh she's working out. Don't, don't you worry about it. Hi, how's my bestie, wee one? Uh, this is for you. It's actually, it's fruit because I like, I know you like to stay healthy, you know, so it's just a little bit, bit of fruit. <gasps> what could it be? I'm going to sing while I open it. A pear. I'm so going to eat this so fast. It's going to be rude. Thanks a bunch. Hey, I want to say thanks, but with like an object, it's a checkered sweater vest. They should gift you items. 
Like, items are so hard to come by in this game. At least if you gift your villager something, they should gift you an item. Ooh, and Hornsby is crafting. Watch your step, of course. What are you doing? I'm making a zen-style stone. One of the bugs on the floor whispered the DIY instructions in my ear while I was sleeping last night, so I gotta build it before I forget what it even is. All right, uh, yeah, teach me. I apparently don't know that yet, so I will uh, take it. And I don't think we could gift him anything, right? Oh no, schnozzle. <laughs> All right, Hornsby. Oh no, I can't gift him, okay. Just because of the recipe crafting, maybe. There is something for you right here that fits your interior, even though that is the starter one. A pear, it looks so good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, Malene, I'm gonna lay in the floor. Yeah, okay, you're also gonna share. A baby romper. Great. <laughs> that is exactly what I wished for, honestly. Okay, so there is Flurry. We've already gifted her. We've already gifted Daily. Uh, none of these are home. We do have Ponte home. I don't remember what her house looks like. Oh, that's right. Yeah, she had the little like spa moment almost. That's kind of cute. Oh my gosh, welcome. Uh, here's a gift. Here is a gift. Oh, by the way, I hear some st some people in the comments being like, you know, her name is now Pate. It's Pate rhyming with Kate. I disagree. You know, considering considering how Nintendo likes to name their villagers as like, you know, a hint to something else. I'm 99.9% .9 certain it's supposed to be Pate. Um, but yeah, re regardless, I'm, I'm going to keep saying that. <laughs> what is it? It's a mystery. I'm going to open it now. A pear, yum. I'm so gonna eat this so fast, it's gonna be rude. Ugh, copy paste and all. A digital scale, see that's the first, oh. Is that what I think it is? Pate, is that what, is that what I think it is? Cause that's kind of rude. Did she give me like a, for cooking? Or is that one that I actually have to? <gasps> that's really rude. Oh my God, you don't gift a scale to people. Listen, I know that I might not be like, ideal whatever but like that's really rude oh my god they should not get oh wow oh wow someone left someone left the landscaping really unfinished there <laughs> um yeah they, they shouldn't gift you that at all the heck the heck is wrong with them okay i so many of my villagers i cannot find is t-bone home t-bone is home okay let's gift him something as well all righty you definitely need a different interior Felt like stopping by my hideout. out. Uh, yep. <gasps> I can't listen. I, I can't. I, ca I can't gift you anything. I'm gonna learn. I'm gonna learn you an important lesson. Convenience is overrated. Let me explain. Take your basic calculator. It makes things too easy. Kids these days can't even add two numbers in their head. They gotta look it up on a phone. Go on. Ask me what 25 plus 17 is. It's 48. Didn't even need to think about it. Kids these days. Yep. 48. Totally the correct number. Yep. I can't gift him anything. I don't like compromising on sleeping comfort. That's why I love my antique bed. Used to be I'd toss and turn out the night. Now it's a quarter of the night at most, Moocher. Aha! <laughs> Great. Why can't I gift him anything? I've had T-Bone for like a while, right? That really doesn't put me in like a good light, does it? Okay, I'm just gonna drop the presents for the ones that we haven't gifted just yet. So I don't, I don't forget to maybe at some point in the future at least. Okay, drop it for Tutu. We haven't seen her just yet. Uh, some of them might be like, oh, hi, Alice. So happy to see you. Wow, this is a weird angle. Uh, this is for you. I've got a little pair here for you. There we go. That's a better angle. I wonder what's inside. Oh, this is great. It's a pair. Thanks. That is so thoughtful of you. Here, I wanted you to have my shop uniform shirt. Okay, great. Thank you. Uh, excuse me. Okay. Um, so Alice, yeah, Daisy we couldn't give because she was uh, listening to the concert. And then we did give something to Pate. We did gift uh, something to Daily. Who else is missing? We gifted Hornsby. Did, you give, did we give anything to Dottie? Yeah, because she was outside her house. Um, Gala? Did we give anything to Gala? I don't think so. Have I seen Gala just yet? Eh, I don't... Is she home? She is not home. Okay, I don't know really where Gala is then. Gala! Psst, psst. Where are you at? 
Ga Gala! Mm. No, I might have to drop it in front of her house. Okay, that's that's fine. We can just gift her at some other point. Okay, oh, also, yeah, the Zen-style stone. Let me learn that. <laughs> Alrighty, perfect. And then as running, as I was running past it, I also just want to check up on the yacht down here. Oh, yeah, actually, that's kind of fine for me. I thought it was going to be more awkward, but, like, you bear... If, if like this, yes, but you're not really going to stand in front of the yacht. So I think you're just going to stand like this, see it, and like a glimpse of it, and then you're just going to walk here. That's perfectly fine. Yep, okay, good. All right, well, once again, you know, nothing really completed. It's, oh god, time just runs too, too quickly. But, again... We're making good progress. We're still gonna put like a custom design, I think, on these. Um, fix the pathing, put some stuff underneath these bistro tables, and um, yeah, fill the rest in with a few, few more things. You know, compared to like a few episodes before, we're making progress, and I'm liking it. Thank you so much again for watching today. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, that was, I think, day five of our full week of Let's Plays. I will probably record another episode today. And in the meantime, I might acquire a few more items so that our decorating in the following episodes can go a little bit more smoothly. We have some things available. We have like enough money and enough like flowers and everything. And then next time we see each other, I think we will maybe even like continue on this one. Or also we could do a little bit of interior decorating maybe. I would not be opposed to that but we'll see until that happens until i see you in the next episode i hope that you have an awesome time bye everyone